Hello, I'm Andy, and I'm going to read to you a program called Weekly Horoscope from March the 10th to March the 16th, 2019, and this is for you coming from Aquarius. First, let me give you my email address, which is andyhoro9, A-N-D-I-H-O-R-O-9, the number 9, andyhoro9 at gmail.com. Now, let's start with Sunday, the 10th of March, which is going to be a nasty morning, afternoon, evening, nightfall period for you. Firstly, in the morning, afternoon, you will attract a lot of blame. So you don't want to be the organizer or want to take charge or want to take responsibility of any kind in the morning, afternoon. If you really have to, you have to be very cautious what you say. And most of all, don't show arrogance. The planets of arrogance will create problems and create people turning against you. Be appreciative, be supportive. And that way you will lessen these planets of ego getting things wrong for you and the finger of blame pointing at you all the time. You have to be choosy of the company you keep as well because just by association your own reputation can go bad. Most of all, don't show arrogance. Evening, nightfall, nasty planets are there. The planets of accidents are there. So don't drink too much, drive carefully. Accidents can also be verbal and emotional, making the wrong choice with whoever you are. You are not safe in the evening nightfall period. And so be careful of treachery or being played out or being let down. Once you sense that something is not right with these people or whoever you're with, take your leave, go back safely home and drive carefully. I don't like the evening nightfall at all. And as I said, watch out for the company you keep. Monday the 11th of March, a lot of water is seen in the morning afternoon. This is horoscope technology or wordology, with the words we use. And when that happens, you become extremely emotional and moody and changeable and without having a direction. And so what can you do? Well, go slow, especially emotionally. It's a working day. It's a Monday. You can't afford to be riddled with this emotionalism. You have got duties to perform at your place of work and in business. So repeat three words to yourself all the time. Logic, facts, figures. Depend on these. Get down to getting your responsibilities going, whether in business or in job. Fulfill that. Otherwise, the distraction you will have will make your mind be very careless and make mistakes. And that's how the day gets, morning gets worse and worse and worse. Emotional disturbances can bring, are going to show emotional disappointment. So put it on the back burner and tell yourself, I've got to get my morning afternoon workload done as much as I can. Evening, nightfall turns wonderful. That's how a day can change. Planets are a bit slow, but they are very good a group of planets in the evening, nightfall. They try to help you in the morning, afternoon, now and then, giving you the spirit to move ahead. But evening, nightfall, you are going to find long-term solutions, long-term meeting with people who are good for you, long-term possibilities of promoting yourself, whether in job, in business. So you've got to be materialistically minded and go out with people who can help you attain what you want, though not just a good time. So you've got the evening, nightfall, hour by hour, things working for you. Let's go to Tuesday the 12th, and it's not going to be a very good morning, afternoon. Why? Planets make you dominating and stubborn. That's bad enough at place of work, in business, or whoever you are with. And that's not going to win you any good points or any good marks. So tell yourself, I'm going to be appreciative and supportive and I'm going to be flexible and negotiable in the morning afternoon period. And wherever you are, that will help you to get ahead and to get the support and to be able to get things done. Evening and nightfall, the planets of anger are there. So you're going to be angry about something or another. Aggression, provocation, don't allow that to come from you while well, you're listening to me. So don't you be the person who creates the problem. If somebody else does that, remain silent or take it easy and move away from that company. Go back to the safety of your own home. So there's going to be aggressiveness or daringness might come from you to do something very daring which you shouldn't do. It could be of the emotional kind, it could be of the business kind, it could be of the job kind. So the whole day, don't be daring and don't be pushy. And be cautious in the evening time, be choosy of the company that you really want. Wednesday the 13th of March is going to be an excellent morning afternoon. You're going to be also lucky. 
So this is the time to talk to your bosses or in business to go chasing for that business that you wanted, that agency lines that you want. And it's a time where unexpected goodness comes because the planets of unexpected goodness are very active. So you're going to get out of the blue opportunities. You can create these possibilities by calling people, by being with people who can help you. And your ideas are going to be very imaginative and your impulsiveness, what you say and do will be good. So you've got to be busy in the morning, afternoon and whatever you say and do is always right. There's a planet of arrogance hanging around. So try to keep the arrogance part of you as low as possible. And so you can do that by remaining polite for a start. Evening nightfall period, the planets of arrogance are there, plenty of them. So you're going to be thinking you're cock of the walk, that everything you say and do has got to be done. You want to take charge. You want to be noticed. You want to be in the limelight. And all that is not good. So these planets will give you the opportunity of becoming popular and in the limelight. They are doing it for the reason to get you into trouble. So you don't want to do that. Be part of a team. Remain in the background. Watch as how things develop. They are not going to develop well for you in the evening nightfall. Things become worse and worse. You could be insulted. You want to retaliate. Don't move away. Better save it for another day. So something very bad and be choosy of the company you keep or you will, your own reputation is going to go down the drain. Thursday the 14th of March is an excellent as far as job business is concerned. Many business planners are there. Your communication levels, your marketing sense is going to be excellent. And you're going to say and do things which people want to hear. So say and do as much as you can. Send messages, ask favors. Communicate as much as you can and whether it's job, whether it's business or whether whoever you are with, you can charm a bird of a tree to chase for the romance that you want. Make the phone call, send a lovely message and you'll get everything that you're looking for in the morning, afternoon. Evening, nightfall, planets turn very emotional. So the group of planets turn very emotional. So they make you emotionally driven, very moody, sometimes easily depressed, sometimes causing stress unnecessarily in your mind by imagining things and also be careful evening nightfall some disappointment may happen so be ready for changes which may come unexpectedly and suddenly so evening and nightfall be a bit on your guard don't get into an argument and you don't need to say things which might hurt anybody Friday the 15th of March is an excellent morning and afternoon. You can expect very good luck, whether in business, whether in jobs, whether with whoever you are. These planets want to reward you. So you've got to be materialistically minded. Go out with the people who can help you, whether job in business or finances, whether in getting you onto a better uh, level of life in any way. So go out with people who matter to you. And that way you're going to be very happy because you're going to come back with the morning afternoon. <coughs> Sorry, with the morning afternoon, you're going to come back with plenty of information because you're going to be also creative as well. So there's so much to gain in the morning afternoon period and you're going to be very lucky as well. Evening nightfall period, be careful. These planets want you to take charge and be dominating and make to become stubborn as well. Don't allow any of that to happen. Otherwise, you'll just spoil all that goodness you built up in the morning, afternoon. Evening, nightfall, be negotiable, be flexible, be supportive, be appreciative. And you will start to make this planets of domination and stubbornness somehow watered down and control themselves. And that way you'll have a wonderful evening, nightfall period. You might meet people who are bossy, move away from them. Saturday the 16th of March, I don't like the morning afternoon period. Somehow you're going to feel cheated or let down or disappointed one way or another. That's the plan. So find out how that might happen. And when you can be on top of it by being knowing that something may go wrong, you'll be able to correct it before it goes wrong. So whoever you are with, or even if you are at work or in business, don't give your plans away too quickly. Keep somehow control of what you say and do. Move away from people who have bad habits, if you detect them. And stay away from people who somehow you know are not honest and truthful. So it's all up to you.
to stay away from trouble or to get into trouble in the morning afternoon period evening nightfall period turns wonderful you can get very lucky in the evening nightfall period that's when you want to chase for the romance you want be out with the people you work with or do business with you will get plenty of returns in the evening nightfall period yes this morning afternoon planets don't disappear into thin air but they can be brought under control in the evening nightfall period so in the evening nightfall period you are impulsively extremely lucky and during the evening nightfall period i see planets of the internet there so go on the internet find solutions make the contacts you want and you'll do extremely well in every area of la- of life in the evening nightfall period that's your saturday the 16th well i'm i've got a 90 minute session and that's going to cost you usd 50 to know your next 7 8 or 9 years based on your date of birth and time of birth and looking at your palms and i'll be able to cover all areas of your life including your health area as well and i'll give you your personal lucky lottery numbers your lucky colors your lucky gemstones your lucky directions a lot of information so that you get your next 7 8 or 9 years as much as possible under your control and so send me an email at andy horo 9 a n d i h o r o 9 the number 9 at gmail.com and i'll reply to you as soon as i can Until then thank you and good luck